Hi, my lovely people. How are you guys? Happy Tuesday. Yes. Ooh, this month is going by so fast. But who's on the menu today, y'all? I had to do some researching. Who is on the menu today? We're going to talk about Phil and Jazz, okay? Now, y'all know how I feel about uh, Philip, right? But one thing I will do is I will give credit when credit is due, okay? I will do that. So, this is my whole thing. I've been uh, checking out some uh, Phil's videos. And thank you to the subscribers who have been, you know, sending me some teas. I uh, thank you. Uh-huh. Anywho, I was watching and I was paying attention, okay? So, when Philip did the, you know, Aiden and Amaya's game, did anybody realize that when he walked into the building, he had a bag of burritos and he said, oh, I brought my mom some food. He went into the facility, the daycare, the... uh basketball arena whatever you want to call it at this point we all pretty know it's like a ymca right but anywho he walks into his mother's office and puts down the burritos now let me say this again he walks in his mother's office and i see a tag that says coordinator okay on the desk therefore this means that philip's mother is the coordinator at the daycare at the center, whatever y'all want to call it, YMCA. So, if she's the facilitator, why are the kids just now getting in the program? Uh-oh. Uh-oh. Now we got to get on some stuff, okay? Now we got to get on some stuff. Now, when Philip was in jail, right? How many times did we see Jasmine get on here and say how stressed out she was? How she couldn't afford daycare? Then people would tell her, please put the kids in sports. Please get them out and about. I can't afford it. I can't afford it. It's so expensive. If you want me to do it, then you go buy it. Da -da 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 -da. Asking her subs to help her. Remember? So, Jasmine, I guess this will be my question, okay? If Philip's mom has a job to where she can facilitate the YMCA, the sports, or whatever it is, were you that cocky that you could not reach out? To Philip's mom and ask her for help. I mean, y'all, okay, first off, let me just say this. Y'all know my situation. I will reach out to my son's uh, father's family if I need something while he's incarcerated. So it just makes me wonder, right? If Jasmine was doing all of this just to be doing it and getting money. Because if I knew someone... When I had a young child that was a facilitator, that was the, especially the grandparent. This is the grandparent of Philip's kids. You mean to tell me you couldn't have called this woman and you couldn't have said, I need help? Now, let's keep in mind now, they were coming to get the kids at one point in time when, you know, Jasmine was having her nervous breakdown, wanting to jump off the patio, balcony, and everything else. They were coming to get the kids. So when they would come and get him, you couldn't have simply just asked for help. Like, look, I'm getting a little fed up. I'm about ready to go cuckoo for Cocoa Puffs. And I just want to help get them some social skills. So once again, Jasmine, this falls back on you for lack of social skills. These, could, these kids could have been in swim classes, YMCA, uh, daycare. They could have been anywhere. And if y'all don't know, the YMCA, if you get Medicaid or food stamps, they give you a family pass for a very low discounted rate. Now, put that with what Jasmine could get, right? And the fact that she knows the woman that runs the damn shit. It sounds like you could have got a lot of stuff for free. That's what it sounds like to me. You could have got a lot of stuff for free. So, I'm going to wonder what her subs think now that she, they know that all this time, Philip's mother could have gotten these children into programs and Jasmine just didn't ask. I'll wait. I'll wait. Now, y'all, another part of that vlog, I got to say, did y'all see Aiden? Y'all, I was sitting over here cracking up. Aiden was like, basketball my butt. Basketball, he turned it into soccer. Y'all, he was flipping all on that damn court. He was losing his shoes. He was having a party, right? He was at the party that nobody knew that the party was going on. I thought that was the funny and cutest thing that I had seen in a long time. Also, when I watched that video of Philip, did anybody realize that he said, man, she's always late. She is always late. That's what she that's what he said. We know she was talking about Jasmine had to be talking about Jasmine because it was the game was almost over when we seen uh, Ava and Caitlin show up. So obviously it was Jasmine, right? 
But Jasmine wants to go and shoot hoops and, you know, bounce the ball around in the damn dirty, oily garage and pretend to be so into it. Wasn't she like the Kobe Bryant of Community College? So why is she not out here helping all her You know, we could keep on going. We could keep on going. I just wanted to make a short video and let y'all know that I caught that and wonder if y'all caught it that Philip Baum actually is the one who facilitates the Y program slash daycare that these children go to. And it could they could have been into a program a long time ago. Y'all, I will see y'all later. I will see y'all down in the comments. I love y'all. Jasmine makes my head hurt because stuff just don't add up. She's so damn worried about Chris that she can't focus on her other kids and her other life. <laughs> y'all, I, I can't wait to hear what y'all got to say.